I'm back. You didn't know I was gonna come right back today, did you? Mm, I got some tea, honey. Kardashian IG account deleted. GameStop workers forced to wear bags on their hands. Let's get into it. Oh, and I'm known it. No seat bill, bitch. I'm trying to go. Don't make me send them goons your way. I'm Crisco. My guns get felt on. Shots pop from the top of drum. Hey, you running like the motor's on. Marathon. Mason Dis Disick turned his private IG account to public and went live. 10-year-old Mason, whose pic I won't show her because he is a minor, went on IG Live and started sharing all the Jenner and Kardashian secrets, honey. The family secrets. He went on live, and during his live stream, Mason gave the answer to the question we all want to know. Is Kylie and Travis back together? Oh, honey, he didn't hesitate. He said, no, they're not back together. Hours after going live, fans noticed that his IG account was deleted. The next day, Chloe confirmed that Scott and herself deleted the account because Mason set it up without their permission. They felt he's 10 and IG has a, a age limit. She says she thinks it's 13. Can someone tell me why her shoes look so big in this video, in this pic right here? Them some big ass shoes. Within 24 hours of his mother deleting his account, Mason went live on TikTok. You can't stop this kid. To thousands more fans. And when asked what happened to his IG account, he did that air quotations saying that I'm too young and I went viral. I'd have 2.7 million of followers by now if I kept it up. Better watch it, Mason. Them big old shoes. Chloe gonna put them up. Uh, not Chloe. Courtney gonna put them somewhere. You better watch it. According to CBS, this is a graph of the stimulus check and how it affects you. They're calling it the CARS Act, C-A-R-S Act. It is the largest stimulus package in history. So as you can see, as I've explained before on my past videos, uh, if your tax liability is a $750,000, you'll cap out at twelve. If your tax liability is $90,000, your check will be $400. If your tax liability is $99,000 or below, you get $0, nothing. That's how they feel. If you are married, just double that. Just double the single amount if you're married. Now, I haven't heard if they're still doing, I guess they're still doing the $500 per child. Maybe they're going to tax that and knock that down too. I don't know. I don't have no kids, so I'm not even worried about it. Some recovering patients in Wuha text tested negative and then positive. These patients have recovered from the virus and are being discharged. As they're being discharged, they're given the COVID-19 test. Te they test negative and then the test turns to positive. So there, the medical staff there is trying to assess the validity of the test. Um, so China is trying to lift the quarantine um, and let the people of Wuhan come out of their, you know, go back to try to go back to normal. 
they are now concerned a second wave is going to start. From March 18th to March 22nd, there were no reported new cases. They are feeling that those that recovered are now testing positive, but show no symptoms. They are asymptomatic, meaning they are carriers. That suggests that the outbreak in Wuhan is not close to being over. I can't even, I can't even speak on it because I can't worry about their backyard. I can't worry about what's going on in China because my backyard need leaves right, okay? I got to worry about what's going on in the U.S. I can't worry about them. But I wish they would get it under control. Please. GameStop employees are being told to wrap their hands in plastic bags to accept payments from customers. Yeah. According to the Boston Globe, GameStop was determined not to be an essential business. Therefore, they were told by the state to close their doors Friday the 27th. The next day, uh, the owner opened the door and offered products via curbside service. Despite the state telling them to shut down, the Massachusetts store owner told his employees, wrap your hands in plastic. Crack the door, take the credit card, run the credit card, flip the bag inside out, leaving the cord inside, throw their products in there, whatever they bought, and crack the door and hand it back out. Are you kidding me? Are you for real? Are you serious? That's just, you really want to make some money. I guess that's... Just a store owner trying to keep his business from going under. He got to do whatever, whatever he got to do. Crack the door like you selling dope. Get they look money. Rake the cord. Flip the plastic inside out. Leave that cord in there. Throw the props in there. Crack the door a little more. Hand it back out. Shut the door. How's that going to stop you from catching anything? How? It's not. Why are you making these people do this? Well, that's all I have for today. Remember the cash giveaway now. I'm trying to give people time to go back through the videos and watch the videos and catch the words. Now, I'm not going to hold off much longer because you should have been watching all along. So, share, like, subscribe. Leave a comment below. And if your favorite YouTuber don't double back the same day and give you some tea, you need to be subscribing. I love you for watching.